Now, the staggering amount of household debt in South Korea has policymakers on edge. Looking to tackle the issue head on, the government has rolled out measures to cool rapidly overheating property markets in areas such as Gangnam. Shin Se-min reports. The government is looking to slap limits on the apartment application system in a bid to stop the real estate market overheating in certain regions. Finance Minister Yu Il-ho says the government wants to regulate speculative investments in areas like Gangnam in southern Seoul, one of the most affluent districts in the metropolitan area. Data from the land ministry shows apartment prices in Gangnam jumped almost 6 percent on average in the first 10 months of this year, while the nationwide figure only edged up half a percent. The restrictions will cover Seoul, parts of Gyeonggi-do province, as well as the administrative capital of Sejong and the southern city of Busan. The limits are aimed at protecting other regional property markets while cooling speculative investments in popular areas. The measure comes amid heated competition to snap up new apartments in some parts of the country, including Gangnam, while other areas face an oversupply of housing. This comes against a backdrop of growing calls to curb rising household debt that hit an all-time high of 1.1 trillion U.S. dollars as of the end of June. It also follows previous government efforts this year to stem the rapid expansion of household debt and requiring banks to institute stricter screening procedures for those taking out mortgages. Minister Yu added that the government will work to monitor economic factors weighed down by uncertainties like the ongoing corporate restructuring drive, newly introduced anti-graft law and potential rate hike in the United States. Shin Samin, Arirang News.